back. I'm looking to grab some information up towards heaven. Yeah, and, and Daps is now permanently on a Sentinel. He had already kind of dabbled with Sentinels in the past, but now he's fully away from the Omen, giving it over to, so, uh, to Zom. So that's kind of another thing to think about as we do see energy. Getting that initial pick at A-Heaven pretty quickly there, thanks to Shanks. So now they're going to be able to pivot back over. There are two defenders here, and it's Inbox hiding in the corner of the box. But that is great trading efficiency from Energy as they will pile into B with a massive advantage. Now they will have a four-on-two post plant ahead of them. That was a rough paint shell. We're going to go ahead and let that one go, though, as they're still well out in front this round. And Pistol Round could still go either way, but this one definitely heavily in favor. Of NRG as they lose one more member, Curtis to find that kill and wow, might possibly another. I'm surprised those shots missed. Ooh, Daps actually gonna swing off the back end of, I believe, a paranoia there. And Curtis still alive, still making things hurt. Paint shell's gonna be queued up after being recharged here. This one gonna get just as much value as we saw from the last. Now I'm running out of time, Curtis. You kind of just gotta send in its Android through the box with the sheriff and our the players to work together and getting the overall strategy going. And this is definitely a, a, a nice little hurdle if they could get past split here, like you mentioned. Not necessarily having the best track record on this map, but right. they being able to pick this one up almost secures that series for you as the flawless round comes through. That kind of much control. They are all over this B site. Yeah, and I mean, the the presence, right? Do you see how much that control means? They actually don't check the back site. And Intox gonna pick up a couple, unfortunately. Now it's down to Stealthy, the last remaining. You know left. what this player can do. We, we caught a little bit of this team, this Demon Time squad, on some of the other broadcasts, I believe the Observer broadcast. So Stealthy, definitely one of those names to look out for. And the Omens throughout the entire tournament really feel like they've been on fire. I don't know how much you can expect from this one in a 1v3 and kind of a tough spot to retake. I was to say, you really are here. building this up to like unfair levels for Stealthy. Like... Yeah, so I'm not expecting him to do too much. I'm expecting a save here. That's nice shot, he finds that first kill. Okay. He Sub Rosa playing towards Sewer's middle, looking to maybe cut off a rotation from B Heaven to Ropes, or something along those lines. It's actually seeing Demon Time like fall all the way back. They're actually going to look to get the res on Stealthy, and it's gonna. I feel like Sub Rosa's going to have to make a big play here. Not Sub Rosa. Saw. I'm sorry. Starts with an S, close enough, and a big play in the works here. Coming up through ropes, able to find a couple of kills, but trading back and forth standing. we go. Red and blue on the kill feed. And I mean, it, you called it out. Toms has to go crazy, unfortunately not able to do it. And Demon Time able to battle back here, getting there. Definitely doesn't help. We might mm. see that, trail. again, that teeter-totter in economy as the Seekers come through. And NRG looking to make a quick play up towards heaven. Nice slow orb. Going to stop him for a moment, but Shanks just starting to mow him down. G-Man able to trade it back, but Android is there. And I mean, Bro, what a solid... The level of respect that he had for that slow orb was absolutely zero. Zero. Just none. But, I mean, you have to feel confident when you have Android behind you ready to trade. <laughs> I mean, really, the whole team, just about the whole team, was pushing up through mailroom. So yeah, it's like even if we, he got his one, and he's like, "I got a uh, arsenal behind me." Yeah. So that's why you had that confidence to push on through, and we can see the impact. Oh, poor stealthy. Android with the flashy no. moves, just oh, moving no. on through. Not the knife. It's gonna be the classic kill, and Psalm will finally. I mean, just the way that Android is kind of moving around at the end. This is the top of the leaderboard, double digits. They're doing stuff. Oh, they're actually reading this play. It was Demon Time trying to get a bit aggressive, trying to feel themselves. Unfortunately, not getting a whole lot. Flash is going to be traded back and forth in EU on the 3K. Now, it was just an eco round, so we can see the idea behind what Demon, Demon Time had going on. But at the end of the day, it's out here on both these sites, not giving up too much. And Stealthy has since joined them on this B site. Unfortunately, taken down there. Android, again, just feeling themselves. Intox gonna find the kill, but they're traded back and forth. Intox goes good for two, but Demon Time still find themselves down a player. Oh, no. Now the odds gonna be even. Ten That's a spike left. down. Nobody on this site to make a play, and you've only got four Enemy seconds remaining. to do it. Curtis gonna find that kill. Now in a 1v. No way! EU almost clutches it out there. Pony takes the fight. Curtis and Pony up top towards heaven. Gonna make sure not a whole lot of value can be played as they look to cut off a beautiful Ooh. flash onto two is gonna net the kill onto Psalm the paint shells. 
Looking to find another. Azeo just trying to flash his way on out. 31 HP in a dream. They have the vision on one. And Eu somehow, some way, still alive as that spike gets planted. We find ourselves in that 4v4 retake. Finally, Intox will find that kill from downtown. And NRG find themselves on the back foot. Yeah, this is so far a pretty good retake from Demon Time. They've done a great job with their sky to get the flashes and start getting some kills towards ramps. And actually, now they're going to get the res on top of it. They have the five on three now. These energy players are boxed in. Daps out of the corner, only good for one. Android does fight back, and so does Shanks. But now he's alone, but he's getting the job done. He's already found a couple, and now he'll win off the clock no matter what. Won't add insult to energy with the daggers, but again, the time is everything. That yep. eco round, so... They tried to stack it and make a play off the back end, but it looks like four members might just get mowed down as they push into the sewers. Pony goes good for another, but EU making sure it's not going to be much on top of it all. Now it's all up to Stealthy, and this guy keeps finding himself in these situations. Spend that A site. They just play off and look for the retake. It's ropes. They've been giving that one up. Ooh. Stealthy going to dodge out on the paranoia. G-Man Chu going to find another kill, and they're looking to grab four here at the half. As Demon Time go up two members on this round and have a couple of big ultimates to try and secure the rest. And Intox with a nice angle to find another. Som trades it back, but Intox goes good for two. Now it's all up to EU here, who's got the guiding light, but the blades wasting any time on this attack as they are pouncing into B Heaven, and they are getting a lot of space right now, and they have a great entry to boot. But the energy response Ooh. is swift. Yeah, three for two across the board, but low HP on Shanks, so easily could be another kill as Daps gonna get spotted out. Looking to find the spray down with the ghost. They're looking to find the head here. The the back and forth that you could get between the Sage and the Sky on the heel, and there it is. The A side opened up, the spike to be planted. Now a 2v2 as a quick rotations come through, and you have to be expecting G-Man, and they do just that. They cut it down to the last one, and unfortunately Intox already Ooh. used it. Tries to spray him down. 3k for 3k, we will trade, but NRG Look at this defense of energy, bro. They already have four players here on B side. It's going to be a B heaven attack, and Shanks able to find one and dash away, being that crafty jet that he is. And we're seeing some response right now, but unfortunately, it's just not a big enough one from Demon Time. And to be fair, they didn't really have the utility word spot here. Ooh, look at him. Oh no, excuse me. It was Shanks into an awkward spot. Going to be pinched between two. Android going to find another kill. Again, Intox, the player to watch out for for this Demon Time Squad, especially here on Split. As the guiding lights go through, the flash is on to three, but G-Man still comes out on top. And Demon Time, against all odds, are looking to battle back. And at this point, not only do you need to win the round, but you need to make sure that your economy isn't hurt too much here as Android. Right. Looks for a spray down, queues up the boom bot here. We'll look to get some information with that. The smoke's to keep on coming through, so that dark cover to slow things down for a moment. Oh. Stealthy picks up one through that dark cover. Som will fall. An Android in a 1v3 has to go crazy, and he's starting to do it. Pops the grape of one. Lots one out towards Pillar, I believe. Knox going to check his corners. No, he doesn't need to. It's G-Man Chu on the peak. And it's you as the guiding lights can be traded back and forth. The Trenzy versus Vandal. The G-Man gonna pick up a couple pony there right behind him. So just mowing them down as they try to get through. It's a hero rifle for a moment. Now it's all up to Dabs. There is a Vandal over there. So Pony doing his due diligence. It's actually just a classic in hand. Dabs actually hasn't been able to pick that one up. He's trying to trade it out. Oh he's my. able to do it. The spike that hurts. has made its way over to B. But yeah, that's a... Uh, if not her clearing out mailroom to make sure that they can step into B Heaven and look, oh. Shanks misses a big shot though. That was really what I feel like energy could have pounced on if he was able to land that. But you know, no harm, no foul. They can still try working this out. Time is obviously against them, but they're starting to get some space. Main shells used, guiding light as well. The wall gonna be taken down. There's a the showstopper from Android, able to find the kills, and it's two more right behind it. Demon time starting to get cut down. Intox has no way in to use that resurrection, and sure, it's planted for B main, but they're just getting run down. G-Man has to do something crazy as the spike goes halfway. Android gonna hop right back on it, and it looks like G-Man opting into the save here right behind it. So, uh, yeah. huge plays from this Sage, and Stealthy on the board there, right next to him, as the wall comes yeah, down. Yeah, and you know, what's tough is if you're playing for retakes like this so often and you don't have a killjoy for a lockdown, it just yeah. makes it like so much harder. I think the Sentinelist comp on this map really can have its cons, I guess is my point, if you're going to have to play retake like this. It leaves for so much to be blind. The showstopper, the paint shells, now the shots start to come through and Android back. 
to kill in ways, but oh, there wow. it is. Intox still alive. This spike is planted default as we see Intox try and sneak away. Now Curtis from the back of the side cuts it down to a 1v1. He's got some utility, but does he have the shots on target? Yes, he does. Taken down. So, I mean, it, it's not the impact fragger in Android, but it's still the utility off the board. No smokes now available. It's going to be a lot on those flashes and the cyber cages. Try and cut things off. A beautiful Ooh. shot. There he is. I said his name before. I said it wrong. This time around, puts a frag right behind it. A headshot tied right to it with the sheriff in hand and with the seekers. I'm going to be looking to run down this Demon Time roster. It's a nice way to even the odds. Now Curtis trying to catch somebody on the rotate here. Might just do just that into the back of heaven. It will go. The showstopper finds a kill. And Pony is sitting nice and pretty up towards a heaven. But they're running out of time. They have to get the spike down on NRG. They just got to try and stop the plan here. EU goes through. He's able to do just that. And they're going to find themselves on the win column. Because Android oh stays my. alive. What a heads up play. All being thrown. Over towards this B main area. Dom with the crazy I love that. Two kills gonna come through, but traded right back. Two for two we go, but a lot of damage traded on to Stealthy. And the resurrection comes through. We'll see what they can do with this one. Cause Demon Time, unfortunately, in the last resurrection, they weren't that uh, too successful. Now the wall is down, so they're able to push on through. So Android just barely gonna miss that window. Demon Time find mm. a kill on the site. Who better than Intox to do it? Now here's Android on the flank. You got Shanks coming up as well. Gonna be from heaven and now uh, gonna be the last one standing. Knives are out though. Anything could happen here. Light armor, knives in a dream, but Pony from downtown gonna pop. Did get the great on the ropes will fall and um, but again, those eco rounds can really go either way with the utility. Unfortunately, EU gonna be sat down. Showstopper not gonna find too much. Paranoia goes through and stealthy to find another here toward mid. It looks just like deathmatch here on split. The action happening right outside sewers. And Dap's gonna give himself up. I don't think we see another ace. It's G Man Chu to find that kill. A fl oh, he is flirting with it here. This <laughs> is danger. And he's gonna go down oh, slow. No. And it's going to lead to his demise across the map. They pick up another. It's stealthy to find two with the operator and a flawless round. All right, on rafters. Now, granted, the play isn't headed that way, but I'm not too sure how much he would have got done there. Fortunately, Plays on the opposite side of the map. It's Shanks with the operator in hand. And the swing Love coming it. out from Psalm to back him up and trade it out. OT number two on the horizon as Demon Time get cut down to their last two. The slow orb. Not going to stop Psalm for pushing for that one. Stealthy going to fake the plant for now, but just get pinched on the site. And OT2 now 5v5 retake. Spike planted. Yeah, Demon Time has definitely been playing a lot of the retakes here. They're going to get a stun on the Shanks and elbow position, but they're not really able to follow up on it. And they, again, they have done a really good job setting up these retakes. It's just sometimes they don't have the trading efficiency they need. And once again, they're, they're setting up for multiple angles. They're going to be attacking from A Heaven, back halls, and A Ramps. They're getting some space, but EU could very well cut off the A Ramps portion. He does spot a player on there. Just oh. smoke, but he misses. Oh no, this opens up the floodgates for Demon Time. It was a headshot, but it was through the wall, and they're just going to top him off. Curtis and Pony able to pick up a couple of kills, and again, it's looking like the attacking side might just fall flat here. I saw an android doing their darndest here. We're down to no a 1v1. Way. No time on the board. NRG some way, somehow have inched it. Aww. Only momentarily, but they don't actually get it down, so buying quite a bit of time, but Shanks back to his winning ways here. Picking up that first kill onto Intox. Arguably one of the strongest members to have taken off the board, especially here in overtime. Android yep. queuing up the paint shells as the guiding light goes through. Not going to find too much information. The shot's coming out from sight, and Android able to find another kill. That is stealthy on the site. They're starting to cut them all down. NRG will pull it out, and who better than Android to find a 3K to close things out? And Demon Time looking to come out on top here in the pistol. Yeah, also they were able to threaten window really well in this round also, so it's making it a little bit harder for energy to like rotate around and retake. But that's an interesting little dash that allows Sam Ooh. a couple of kills and actually gets energy back into a winnable scenario in this three on three. But Intox picks a perfect remaining. timing to commit the peak onto Sam. G Man Chu pitches it as well, all onto EU now. And it's fast. Yeah, again, I imagine we're going to see a lot of that uh, throughout this half, just considering what agents are being played by Demon Time coming into this. And again, a fast-paced style can be very effective on a big map, right? Because the defense is out of position. So Demon Time will find plenty of entries. It is just one player left at Psalm on the Omen here. He's in the right place, but that is the least of his worries. He forces this quite a lot, if I'm honest. 
So this is going to be a good read to tell us how good they are at coordinating it. Mm -hmm. A nice take back right into window. This is the rifle round for NRG. They need to pick this one up should they want to keep their economy in a good place. So I'm going to get all the way across, but get spotted out his shoulder just peeking on through and... Now everybody getting corralled over towards this garage area. d man two, two still from downtown, but the rifles come out on top in the long range battles and NRG only lose two in their first round win. Stealthy out, sticking true mm. to his name and about to have both smokes available. So I would imagine they hit on the horizon as oh, Android no. able to find a kill across the map, but it's Intox again, the curveball. They're reading NRG so well on this A site. Yeah, they are getting some really good frags here. They're using their utility very well. And now they're gonna, you know, force that respect and actually back off over towards B. Som already spotted by the boom bot as well. And Intox catches Angela trying to creep through sewers. So everything going Demon Times way right now. They're playing this fast paced style very effectively. But ooh, look at Som ninjaing his way up top, finds a couple of players, leaves it all to G Man Chu. And how does he get away with this? Spotting out four. Curtis Q's up. The boom bot there. Android has the run it back available. Now needs to look for a couple of frags. Unfortunately, he looks the wrong way. Still almost gets some value, but EU is there to back it up. Saw him from the back of the site. And it's all down to Stealthy in a 1v3. Low on HP now as he's getting challenged. He was planted for long, but they sniff it out in a shock dart to sit him down. NRG, they're not going back to the complacent ways. They're taking the fights right to demon time, and they're winning. And this is the problem with Sentinelist comps, right? You need to be watching your flank, and they're not doing that. They're able to find a couple kills. No, Android goes good for three. Mowing them all down towards the C site. Pony remains. trying to get something back, but Android to sit him down. And the ace on the horizon. It was an eco round, so quite possibly to be expected. I don't think Stealthy is long for this world. As they spot him out of shock dart and they get a bit of damage, they're going to hand over the ace to... Now that spike to go down, they keep planting for long. This has been the defaulted position. No NRG, they're privy to this, and they're just starting to mow them down on site once more. C is not safe. They're going to have to try and find another way in. But from downtown through the smoke, Intox picks up a headshot onto the diffuser. G Manchu queuing up the Hunter's Fury, looking for some tags. Here comes the flank. Doesn't matter if you have a Sentinel or not. Your team will be flanked, but either way, Android picks up a 3k, still has the running back available. In a, in a That's win. a big dart, holy oh. cow. Yeah, not only finding the kill, but onto Intox. Again, I was just about to say, the win condition for Demon Time is to get Intox rolling. And Shanks finds a collateral towards Lobby, dashes away to safety, and is able to make it out. And G-Man has no oh idea, not God. too sure where he went. <laughs> Dude, it's one of those shots as well that every single time and they know where that spike is being planted it's planted out towards long i'm surprised they didn't start shooting through the box sooner as the run it back gets used android trying to get a whole bunch of value paint shells taking quite a bit of health off the top there and unfortunately gonna get sprayed down now the drone to get some info and i mean it's kind of a stalemate thus far pony still looking to come online there's android but intox able to trade it back but here we go it's phoenixes it's omens to find the kills here and back and forth once more shanks back on the board and from downtown, G Man Chu, once more. We've seen this, uh, we've seen this position before. And yep. unfortunately it didn't work out too well. And this time he doesn't even have the Hunter's Fury. He's just gonna get run down. The attack even starts and already the ult's been burned. Yep, run it back, sent right back. Shanks goes good for another shot on the Intox. The damage is just too much. And Android is here to back him up. That's exactly what you need to have for your jet. The operator can get out of dodge. Now it's down to the last two are corralled here over towards sewers. Shank's gonna oh find my. another, not a collateral, but could close it out with one more shot. No, Curtis starts to battle back. It is being watched. And again, there is a Sentinel here. So this is what the Sentinel brings to your roster. Once that trap wire goes down, they'll surely know that, they surely know that somebody is on the flank. And Daps is just say okay to buy all the time in the world. Now through the smoke they go. Curtis able to pick up a kill. You trades it back though. Unfortunately, not oh gonna my. amount to a whole lot. There's Pony on the flank and Daps to run him down. Now Demon Time have to get something done with their last three remaining. Curtis is actually on the defuse, but he does get <laughs> spotted out and take a curveball allows Android to get out towards mid and a kill traded back. Classic gonna pick up that one. So there's a gun down. Should they? able to push up to it the spike is yet to be picked up so are you gonna go back and retrieve that one for his squad unfortunately demon time down to their last three and very low hp on pony make it their last two and 
Not going to be their last one. Shanks pushed through. No, G-Man with the nice shot there. Nice little upgrade as well. It is a 3v2, but again, the health there is just so low for Pony. There's also one on the flank. So Som could get heaps of value here in just closing out this round. Yeah, it's going to be tough here, but okay. All of a sudden, there is a little bit of hope with that kill in this 2-1-2. Dat still has a good position here inside the corner. going to be tough to clear. And indeed, he will have no chance to answer me and answer yep. it myself. I <laughs> feel bad. Fine. I'm sorry, bud. No, you're good. I'm, I'm glad. That's, you know, the, the self-realization. I think that's good. Standing ahead. Yeah, it's no, like you're, you're teaching me, but letting me do it, you know? Exactly. Exactly. Appreciate you. But... Oh, it's, it's all for you, guys. It's all for you. Now we see Rifle go in the hand of Demon Time, and they're able to get a couple of kills. Intox still trying to close this one out. I think it was a Guardian in the hands of EU here. 7 HP and a Dream, unfortunately, just getting mowed down. And again, Demon Time find themselves down a player on the defensive end. Ain't shells go through just a moment too late. Curtis will fall, and it's all up to G-Man. The Hunter sure is. He tries to dodge on out. He's got to give it everything, and he's running against the clock oh boy blaze oh goes boy. up he will hop out and psalm will